As you begin to look at your profession or your career, what is it that you need to do to begin to upgrade your skills or your knowledge to continue for you to be competitive in the marketplace? As you begin to look at yourself and ask some of these questions, what is something that you're good at? Are you living your passion? Are you living your dream? What do you regard as your greatest personal achievement? What is the one thing that other people can do to make you most happy? As you begin to look at yourself and look at where you want to go with your life, it's very important for you to ask yourself a question as you look at various areas of your life. Is what you are doing right now, is it giving you what you want? If it's not giving you what you want, it's going to take courage to decide to do something differently. What's the worst thing that can happen? You're saying, I'm not getting what I want. As you begin to look toward the future, begin to know that whatever it takes for you to create that, you've got that in you. You've got that. You've got genius in you. You've got goodness in you. You've got creativeness in you. If you decide to take the initiative to change the current quality of your life, I say to you that you will find that the universe is on your side. That life is on your side. People spend their life not wanting to deal with the pain of rejection, the pain of defeat, the pain of being disappointed, the pain of losing, the pain of failure, the pain of being criticized, the pain of not being liked, the pain, the pain, the pain. That's called life. Life is full of pain. It's everywhere. But guess what? There's no gain without pain. As you look at your life, ask yourself the question, what would your life be like? What would your life look like if you decided not to care what people thought of you? It's unlimited of what you can do. That's the capacity of human beings. It doesn't matter how many mistakes you've made. It doesn't matter how many flops you've had. It doesn't matter how much money you've lost. In fact, I see it only as an investment of what you learn from life. Not losses, but investments of what's possible for you. And I say to you that once you start listening to yourself and as you begin to act on your dream, as you start just trying to find your way, doing what you can, with what you have, you will start seeing things opening up for you. You'll start attracting people.